What are you telling me, people? This message is only for the chosen ones and the selected beings out there. You gotta stand. All of you people that click on my video that ain't chosen, man, you're just eavesdropping, literally. This is not for you, so not for you. But yeah, um, chosen ones, our enemies are realizing that they just come to the realization that everything that they had done didn't prosper. You gotta understand. These people thought they would have their way with us from everything that they'd done to us. You know what I mean? Just because we didn't give the reaction to these people that they wanted, they thought they that they, they thought they actually got over on us and everything they spoke over our life and done behind closed doors and just done to our face. Thought all worked in their favour, but only to see everything that they'd done to us only made us ten times stronger, more wiser, and just more. You know what I mean, bro? This made us more wiser in general. Literally, now we know how to deal with these people out here and how not to be with them, you know what I mean? But yeah, as I said, these people really thought they had their way with us because of everything that we let slide, you know what I mean? Just because we didn't say nothing to them or they just let one thing slide. Now, these people have come to the realisation because they have, they've been defeated now. These people know they've been defeated and there's nothing they can do. See, and this is not, this is the time where they start to reap karma in their life. And Because of how much they've probably, probably done to people in the past, but trust me, they're gonna get a big realization now because of coming up against me and probably all the people that they come up against in the past. But right, you know what I mean? You just made your life even ten times worse. It's coming up against me. I can't lie, bro, because you don't know how you don't know how heavily protected I am and how much I really know. You know what I mean? And this is why you need to watch your mouth, man. You literally, you're putting your mouth on me. I wouldn't have done the same thing to you, but it's okay because I already surpassed you. I left your ass back in the past. And what the fuck do I need to be nice to you for now, bro? Literally. That's what I mean, bro. Literally, I surpassed all of you people. Literally, you're like my servants, bro. All of you people. Just... You thought you were above me talking all this shit. Literally, let's see you talk some shit now. That's what I mean, bro. You are love to talk shit when I didn't have nothing, but let's see you talk some shit now. I, I, exactly, I don't think it's going to happen because you know better. And this is what I mean. These people didn't know better in the past. I'm telling you, bro, these people probably put their mouth and all of this extra stuff on other people, done all these actions. And the thing is, whatever they do to other people, they think they could do it to everyone. So they they gone, uh, gone across all these people and done all this shit. And then they thought they could try to come to me. Me! You can't come to me. You're going to learn something today, bro. I don't care. I'm telling you, from just for coming up for me, from all of the people that you've done wrong in the past, you're going to know why you're, you're receiving karma in your life. I don't know who I'm talking to right now, but I'm talking to someone out there that's done some sneaky shit behind closed doors, bro. Literally. You're going to learn, bro, because you think whatever you do... Ask yourself, whatever you've done, do you think it's nice, bro? Do you think it's nice to be speaking all these things over people's life and all this evil stuff behind people's backs? Trust me, you're going you're gonna to get a... I taste your own medicine and you're going to see how how rough times are going to be for you and how no one's going to be there behind behind you to come back you up. You know what I mean? I went through all of this on my own and trust me, everyone that's come up against you is going to reap some hard karma and some hardships in their life. And I'm not even I'm not even going to I'm not even going to laugh at when this stuff when this stuff starts happening because God's going to give me insight on all of the all of the karma and things people are going through in their life. And I'm just going to sit back and just be like, it's well deserved. Literally, I don't need to laugh at people's misery. You probably laughed at my misery only to see me get elevated. But that's just how people are nowadays. They're just evil, bro. Literally. They just like to laugh at people's situations and... Yeah. But it's okay because these people got a divine payback in the end chosen ones and... Now they're reaping it, literally. It's, the, it, it's their season to reap what they sown, literally. All of the times when these people um, seen us as nothing, ignoring us, you know what I mean? Doing all this malicious stuff. It's okay because everything that these people are done in the darkness and all this extra shit is now being just blown up in their face because... We haven't stopped what we're doing, you know what I mean? 
if you're a chosen one like me and you still have a vision and you're still still going and going strong man these people are watching from the from the sidelines and they're like how is this guy still going how is he not stopped yet it's because i have the lord with me and the willpower that i have at this point i have the willpower of a warrior and someone that don't give up literally i'm not giving up bro because the amount of hell that i went through it could have taken it, it could have taken me out bro i'm telling you i was going through too much spiritual warfare people putting all these evil curses over my life and i'm telling you but i was going through it mentally and i was just going through it but i'm telling you i'm telling you, whatever people sent away could have taken me out and this is why i don't take this is why i'd be careful with these people out here now because i really could have these people could have sent me in the grave i'm telling you what i made it through but it's okay because when these people go through the same thing, they ain't be able to go through what I went through because they ain't as strong as me. You already know you're not as strong as me. And this is why I laugh, bro. You put your mouth in me only to see your only to see yourself get cut off, bro. Literally. You just got your you just cut yourself off out of my life. And you kicked yourself out the door. And you dug your own ditch. Literally, people dug their own ditch in my life, and this is why I laugh even harder. All of the things that you've done. Oh my God. See man. Nothing goes unseen and nothing. Remember there's always actions for your consequences out here. So be careful who you mistreat and be careful who you speak over. Because now look. You're starting to see that there's repercussions for your actions. And I ain't going to be light with people this time. I'm telling you. I'm going to make sure you go through whatever the Lord sends your way. And I'm not going to feel sorry for you one bit. Because... No one felt sorry for me when I was at the bottom going through all these hardships. So, you know what? You can go through the same thing and I ain't going to help no one out, neither. Trust me, this season I'm going to start switching up and being different with people now. Because I've come from a long, a long place and a state where... But I just came from a state, a state of doing some crazy shit, you know what I mean? And I made it out. <laughs> but so as I said, bro, now these people are come to the realisation that you need to watch who you put your mouth on. See, now these people are realising that they need to watch who they put their mouth on now because they don't know who can be elevated one day. And, you know what I mean? Literally, they, they people know who better... People know will think twice and th think twice about who to gossip about now because, or to the speak like speak bad on because they don't know who can be risen up one day. Literally, these people don't know I was, what these people don't know the plans God had for me, and this is why, this is why I, I was kind of happy because these people don't even know the, the plans that God had for me. But everything that they tried plot over my life, nothing prospered. Then I just elevated and surpassed these people and look back at them. And see how low they are, bro. This is what I mean about these low vibrational people. They're just low. And this is why I'd be careful around them. And yeah. Don't, as I said, chosen ones, don't be loyal loyal to all these people that weren't loyal to you in the first place, bro. Literally, none of these people are loyal to me out here. Bro, I ain't going to be loyal to none of you people. What the fuck? Literally. That's what I mean. Now, now... I, now that I went through all of that shit, bro, there is no second chances, no third chances, bro. There's only one chance. You screwed it up, bro. I'm just going to get... You're gone. Forever as well. No more. No more chances now. That's it. Because now I see how you people are. Literally. Man. It is crazy. Can't believe I went through all of that. All of that. And I said, you're watching me from the camera, but you really don't know what I went through behind closed doors. I'm telling you, I was going through some hell in my life bro, at, at, a, at a certain point. And this is why I'm preaching this message on the camera, because other chosen ones could probably be going through the same thing out there. You know what I mean? But yeah, chosen ones, the, the best thing you can do is just keep pushing forward and don't stop. Whatever, whatever you're doing, it could be your business, your YouTube channel. Don't stop. I'm telling you, don't stop. Because the minute you stop, that's the minute the devil will come in and try try his tricks again. This is why I told you to keep, to keep on going, keep on going and don't be stagnant and keep going and don't stop. 
See, I'm not stopping, but I'm just going to keep going. And this is why I'm, you should t take me as an example. You know what I mean? Take me as an example of how you how to keep going and just keep shit pushing. You know what I mean? Literally, after everything people put me through, I still keep it pushing, bro. And this is why I laugh, because I know these people can't do the same thing. But yeah, don't be loyal to these people out here that weren't loyal to you. You know what I mean? Fuck that. Now I know how people are, bro. There's no way I'm going to be loyal to all these people out here. That's what I mean, bro. It's like everyone, every, it's like a, it's like everyone in my reality, it's like they've all been cut off, bro, it's like, it's crazy, it's like all the people I had in my life before, oh, hello, this, that, bro, it's like it's fully eradicated all these people now, and it just feels like I'm on a clean slate. It's just like I have a clean slate, and it's like, every betrayal that happens to me, it's like, has it, it's like, God's making it to the point where all them betrayals didn't even happen in the first place, because it's like I'm being refurbished, you know what I mean, like, you see like a, a car that's been in an accident, and it's being repaired. It's like that, bro. It's like I'm being refurbished, bro. Into a new person and just into a new life. But the crazy thing about everything, these people will want you to, like, not forgive them, but they will want you to let them, let let you let them back in your life like nothing happened. This is what I mean about these people. Now that they're going through their karma, and now that they see how how many steps they are behind me now they see that wow i want to get back in this guy's life wow i want to be cool with this guy again wow you know what i mean they now they're coming up with all these assumptions in their head but why would i want you back you got to ask yourself all that shit that you've done to me why would i want you back for because you already know what you've done to me behind closed doors i said i might not know but you know and this is why I leave these people alone now. I'm telling you, but I leave these people alone because I know better than to mix myself up with all these people out in this matrix. You know what I mean? I already learned. I've, you know what I mean? I've already been through it once, and I ain't trying to. But I ain't trying to go through it again. I've already been through it once, and I'm not trying to go through it again. I'm telling you, what these people put me through really could have put me in a grave. Spiritually, like these people really fucking me up spiritually. I never knew about spiritual, the spiritual knowledge in this world, but when I started to pick up on it. And how much spiritual attacks were coming my way, bro. I was receiving too much shit in my life. And it was killing me, bro. But, man. I just keep making shit happen because... I'm just like that, you know what I mean? I just got that... That heart of a warrior. Even when I was going through bad times, I still kept... Still kept up my vision... Still kept up what I was doing. And this is how I know I'm going to re reap my rewards hard. And and this is how I know my enemies are going to reap their karma even harder. Shit, man. you got to understand. My enemies are going to reap their karma hard. All our enemies are going to reap their karma hard, chosen one. It's over. This is our season and it's their season to lose. And yeah. Telling you, bro. Man, man, this is our season, this is our season, it's our season to reap everything that we have sown, and it's their season to reap everything they have sown, you know what I mean? All of the good seeds that we put are planted in the ground is being blossomed, and all of these seeds, that all these bad seeds that people put in the ground are now being thrown back into them in, in their own life for... And when these people go through it in their life, when you go through it in your life, whoever's watching this, whoever's going through it, when you start to go through things in your life, just know why you're going through it. Literally, you'll know why you're going through what, what you're going through. And that's why you need to be careful. Literally, be careful who you put your mouth on and who you do all this extra stuff to because you don't want to reap no... Once you go through this karma, you'll know, you'll know never to do this to people again, I'm telling you. Because these people thought they can keep keep up their, all their evil, still keep it up. See, I just had to p place all these people in their spot and tell them about their skin and start exposing people out here. That's what you got to do. You've got to expose these people out here. And I don't care, bro. Literally, you could be anyone watching this, bro. I don't care, literally. Because I'm done being... I'm Literally, I'm done. I'm at, I'm at the point where I'm done being friendly with people. Literally, I'm just at the point where... 
I'm just getting rid of people, literally. And this is why I just come on here and just come talk from my heart. Because I'm not holding nothing back. Literally, when I come in here and I get serious, I don't hold nothing back. You, you, you can see I'm not holding nothing back. See, I come in here and I come on serious because I am serious right now. And yeah, man... And it's crazy, see, watch how good our life's going to start to end up, Chosen Ones. After everything that we went through, we're going to start to receive a ton of blessings and there's a ton of miracles coming our way. And these people are going to get a whole bunch of bad shit their way. And these people are going to learn to not just do anything to anyone, you know what I mean? And I know better than to associate with all these people out here now, literally. I really just... I just stay low key now, I'm telling you, because I ain't going through no more shit no more, I can tell you that. But yeah, man. It's great out here. It's great out here. All the chosen ones that went through hard times in their life and overcome it, drop it down in the comment section below. You gotta understand, drop it down in the comment section below and let me know that you overcome what you went through. Literally. But at this point, see, our enemies really thought they had their way, but only to see they just led themselves into the ditch that they dug for us. They led themselves into that. They, these people left, led themselves in, into their own demise, bro. And you leave these people here now. And see, if these people ever try, you know what I mean, all these people that done you wrong, if these people ever try to come back, come back into your life and when these people come back around, because these people are going to try to come back around, you know what I mean? After the, now they see our, su uh, see our success, they're going to try to come back around and come back into our life. But chosen ones, put your foot down on these people. I'm telling you, put your foot down. When these people come back around again, make sure you put your foot, around, put your foot on these people because this is their final point, bro. There is... Make sure you put your foot down on them. There is no more coming back for no more people, I'm telling you. Put your foot down on people. And stop them right there, bro. Because we never come all this way to let everyone back in the past that... You know what I mean? We, ain't, we, didn't, come, we didn't come all this way to let everyone from the past come back into our life and just live, live up. You know what I mean? Just live all happily. No. You're going to go through some hardships and you're going to learn your lesson, bro. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make sure I teach a lot of people out here a lesson. Because what the fuck do I need you back for? Literally, I'm going to make sure you learn a lesson. To never just put your mouth on anyone and do all these evil things behind people's backs and all this extra shit. You're going to learn from me. And I'm going to make sure it's gone. I'm make sure you, you're going to, whatever you did, but I'm going to make sure you reap it a hard blow because me, I'm relentless. You're going to know how relentless I really am and how hard, how hard working I really am. And see, you can say sorry to me and all this extra stuff, but I really don't care, bro, because you could have said sorry many years ago, but you want to say sorry now because you see how far I've gone. Literally, someone won't apologise to you unless they know they haven't done something wrong, you know what I mean? Literally, you already know what you've done to me is bad, and you shouldn't have done it, and you can... Literally, you're going to learn from the actions that you make, because if it was the other way around and I try to go back to all these people, it wouldn't work, and this is why... I'm going to be harsh on these people now. Literally, you thought I was nice before? I'm going to show you how nice I really won't be. This is what I mean about these people. They really think I need them, think I'm just because I'm nice for them. I'm going to show you that taking someone's ni niceness for weakness it, it ain't going to get you far, bro. I'm going to show you that, yeah, being nice can... Being nice can get you far, bro, I'm telling you. I usually be nice to everyone, but... I'm going to show you why you don't take people's niceness or weakness. I'm going to show you the other side of me. And I know you won't like it. And I don't care, bro, because I don't like a lot of things that a lot of people done to me, but they still done it. So I'm going to put you through the same cycle and let's see how you like it. And this time it's going to be... I'm going to make it for a long time, bro. Trust me, you're going to reap some hard... Some hardships, bro. And I ain't going to feel sorry one bit. And you can think I'm this, I'm that, but you can say anything you want because none, of, nothing, none of your opinions or nothing you say over my life is gonna prosper anymore. And this is why I laugh, because 
I won. I won the battle. See, chosen ones, we won the battle of our enemies. Our enemies are now sitting back behind closed doors, miserable, crying, asking other people, how, how has this guy done this? How has this guy done this? I'm telling you, our enemies are sitting behind closed doors, really trying to figure out like how we actually overcome everything. And because they're thinking, what I sent this guy's way should have taken him out. What, what, what I sent this way shouldn't have made this guy what he is today. How is this guy still doing this? Man, this is what happens when you're a warrior. See, you don't know, you don't know how much of a warrior I really was just because I was nice to you. But man, people are about to start reaping some hard karma this season. I'm gonna laugh and I'm gonna start to live up with all my blessings. <laughs> and you'll know why you're receiving it, bro. Literally, it's well deserved. And let's see how you do a bit this time. I'm gonna laugh, bro. Literally, all these low vibrational people. I think they can come up against me only to see they've been stopped in their tracks. Funny, funny, funny money. Oh. Well, chosen ones, you made it. We made it to the other side. We made it to the other side in the to the pearly gates, and these other people made it to the other side in the in the devil's world. You know what I mean? These people wanted to listen to the devil and listen to the devil. All of the things that the devil whispered in these people's ears. Let's you can. You, you're, you're starting to realise that listening to the devil don't get you far. Literally, I didn't listen to the devil. You listen to the devil. Literally. And you can, you're can you starting to see that listening to the devil is only short term. See, I listened to God and I made it far. I made it far listening to God long term. You listen to the devil short term, doing all this stuff to me, think it's going to prosper. And it didn't. And see, I listened to God long term and I won. You, you won the short battle and I won the long battle. See? And the last laugh is the last la the last laugh is the best laugh, I tell you that. Remember, because now everything's on the other hand, bro. You I mean everything's on these people now. And literally, what do I need to look back in the past for? I'm just moving up in the future. <laughs> and watch how life's watch how great life's gonna get for us chosen ones. And these people are gonna just sit back and watch everything that God does for us and everything that he does and, and everything that he does and not be a part of it. And that's the best part about it. These people are going to have no part of what we have going on. And yeah. Fuck you know, man. It's our season. It's our season. But as I said, bro, let these people think... Whoever's big and bad enough to say what they have to say, let them, let them say what they say, bro, because... If you think you're big, big and bad enough to say all these things behind my back and do this extra stuff, well, you can be you can be big and bad enough to receive all the consequences for what you have done. You know what I mean? Because let these people do what they do, bro. You know what I mean? That's what I do. I just let these people do what they do. I don't I don't try to control these people. Nothing. See, and all of their actions are now coming to the surface, and it's really hitting them now. And trust me, I'm not gonna be. As I said, I'm going to be relentless with this. I'm going to let you go through all of that karma, all, all of that hell in your life. And I wouldn't give two fucks about it, bro. Literally, I don't care what happens to you because you couldn't care what happens to me. And that's what I mean, literally. And these people are going to try to come back somehow, some sort of way, try to find a way back to me. Bro, none of you are making a way back to me. I tell you that. You can just leave me alone, bro. I'm telling you, I just want these people to leave me alone. After what you put me through, I want you to leave me alone for the rest of my life. And that's how it's going to be, bro. I'm going to make sure of it as well. Because whatever you spoke of over my life, I never would have done the same thing. And that's the that's the sad part about it. I never would have done the same thing to these people what they've done to me. And this is why I leave these people alone in the Matrix. And I've learned that now. I've learned it. And I leave these people alone now. I just ignore people out here. And that's it. Which I know better than to associate myself with all of these people out here. Because they're just low, bro. And chose the ones to do the same thing. Literally, stop being harsh on these people because these people are harsh on us in a, in, at a certain point in time. Give these people a taste of their own medicine. God damn, man. But, shit. We made it anyway. You know what I mean? Chose the ones, we made it. Life's going to get great for us. And all of the obstacles and all them trials and tribulations we went through was for a bigger purpose. And it was to wake us up to 
our calling. You know what I mean? If I didn't go through all of that, I wouldn't have woken up to my calling. And you just made me 10 times stronger. I'm telling you, you just made me so much more stronger. I was already strong before and you just made me even 10 times stronger. But man, you... But yeah, we won. I made it. Chosen ones, we made it. Man, it puts a t it puts a tear in my eye when I when I look back at all the shit I went through and how far I really made it because you really don't know how much I've been through because you ain't living in my shoes. As as I said, if you were in my shoes, you'll know what I'm talking about, but you don't. And as I said, the, most time these people know in the back of my, their minds how much I've been through, but. It, really, it it don't phase them because it ain't them, and this is why I don't get. I don't. This is why I don't care about these people now. Now it's got to the point where I don't care about these people now, because that's what I realize. People out here just out for themselves, and whatever they can get out of you. And this is what I realize. This is why I just push all these people to the side now and just put them in their place. But yeah, shit, man. I'm telling you, one thing in life you don't want to do is be nice to the wrong people. See, that that was my worst problem. I was, I was gullible and nice to the wrong people, and it led me down the wrong... You know what I mean? It, it, it got all these people in my life trying me, bro. I'm telling you. This is why I tell you, don't be nice to all these strangers and all this extra stuff out here, because, as I said, you don't know, you don't know these people. That's what I realised. You really don't know these people out here. Always be careful of who you just mess about with you know what i mean because all of the energy that people are sending sending my way from when i was younger bro it's like it was attached onto me but all of them cursed them evil spells bro it's like all the energy it's like i had to fight it when i was going through my seeing attention journey it's like i had so much energy just overwhelming me and it was really bro it's, it was actually it was making bro i'm telling you i was going through hell Shit. but man I don't care, I'm here today to tell the tale. Chosen ones, drop a like and a sub. I love all of my star seeds out there. But stay tuned. I'm out. I'm out. Peace.